Welcome back to me screaming. Good morning guys and welcome to my first day of college ever. That's crazy. Eh. Today is October 1st, 2020, so it is a Thursday and I only have one class that was supposed to be on Tuesdays and Thursdays, but it's actually asynchronous. And my professor decided not to have any class or anything today because it's just week zero, not week one. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I'm doing for college today. And then I will go ahead and fast forward us over to tomorrow so you guys can see my first day in those classes. I love asynchronous classes, guys, because basically I was going to be super busy. I was going to go to class and then go to work for like five hours after and I didn't know when I was going to have time to do my homework or anything but luckily we have asynchronous and that means I can work at my own pace and get her done I'm going to go ahead and print my syllabus review it get ready for the quarter because she didn't post it until last night so I'm a little nervous don't know what it's gonna be like So I just watched the intro video. Sounds like this class is kind of gonna slap. Um, the professor seems super um, understanding and she knows someone that like works in like ABC and I'm like, girl, that's like where I'm trying to be. So like maybe I'll talk to her about that. I don't know how to talk to professors. <laughs> like how do you just, can you just strike up random conversations with them or do they have to be school related? I don't know how to do this. But the quizzes are open book, open note in this class. So that is fire. Oh my God, this is a long syllabus. Girl, I'm gonna print it out though. On recycled paper, reduce, reuse, recycle. So apparently my printer does not like reducing and reusing and saving the environment already breaking down over a printer jam. I printed out the syllabus. So now I'm gonna go over it again and put all the due dates into my day designer. Also, these are the three binders that I'm using for the school year. Aw, one of my SPOP leaders reached out to me on Instagram. That was nice of them, wishing me a happy first day. Another kid also did that to me. So shout out to Fiona, that was so sweet, made my morning. That was overwhelming. So basically, if you guys don't know, I'm about to do like an entire video on this, but um, I was always planning on doing a gap year because I'm so burned out in my brain and I don't, I, don't, I don't get to do it now. So... So I apologize that the screen is like freaking out at you guys because it's a camera, but I just wanted to show you guys the introduction slides that I made for my Education 40 class. I don't think they're due till like Tuesday, but I wanted to do them because I'm a busy woman, so I need to do things like ASAP. I'm hoping I didn't rush into it. Like, I feel like now I'm like worried that it's gonna be like messed up because I went too fast because I was too excited. Like when I was writing dates on my planner. Anyway, so we had to include our year, our major, why we're interested in education, a picture of ourselves. And then I also included other fun facts. It said to do like a slide, but I hope they're okay that I did too. I just can't resize it because I need Canva Pro to do that. Are they gonna think I'm weird? Because like this just like went up like two hours ago and I just did like everything they already asked. I don't know. Let me see. It's due. Yes, due by Tuesday, and then I have to comment by, on other people's posts by Sunday. On, should I should I do it? I'm nervous. Let me. I proofread things so much. Okay, I'm gonna proofread it again. <laughs> Am I doing this right? <laughs> Shoot my goot. I feel like I covered everything they need me to cover. I don't know, and I'm nervous to post it. I feel like nobody else is gonna have posted it yet, so I'm like nervous. Because you you also can't see replies until you reply, so I figured out how to do it. It's a weird way. I had to do it through Canvas, not through Google Drive. I don't know what's going on with that. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I did it. I'm the first person to do it. I hope they don't get mad at me for like kind of working ahead because technically that was for week one and we're still in week zero. But I mean, if it was available, I'm sure we're fine. Well, my hair looks pretty. I'm gonna plan my weekend because there's a lot I need to get done outside of schoolwork, and I want to get that all done before like school really kicks it into high gear. Later that night. I just got like the email about like my other, my third class that I'm taking. I'm only taking three classes this quarter, okay? Only three. And I don't know when I'm gonna get to do any of the readings and assignments and I am distressed. I'm gonna go through and put all those dates in my planner now and then I have a singing lesson. And I have my work evaluation tomorrow. So we just got a lot going on. One upside though to this class is that the midterm and final are open book and open note. Thank Thank the Lord, two out of three of my classes are open book and open note.
now we're gonna fast forward to tomorrow good morning guys it is now october 2nd 2020 it is still part of my first day of college i guess in a way it is 8 or 9 a.m i have a class at nine o'clock but he really like goes for punctuality so he recommends we join the zoom like early so i'm probably gonna get on at like 8 50 maybe even 8 45 to make sure i like logged in right with the right school zoom and everything i am gonna start today off though by emailing my boss because for my degree you need to do field work and it turns out my job counts as that i'm pretty sure so that's lit because i get so many hours in with everything going on right now so i'm gonna finish that field work real quick with my education 40 class i feel like my job will help me out with that because like it'll give me real life examples to talk about and then i feel like that class will help me with my job and it's just a win-win let's see how today goes i am just worried about euro studies because i was reading that syllabus i was like i don't know anything that he seems to think i know also guys last night when i was feeling like overwhelmed and everything i decided to do this thing i wasn't gonna do it but then i was overwhelmed anyway so i saw it on tiktok and basically people just like put down all their assignments and the due date and then they organize it by the due date so now i know what is coming up for me there's still some stuff that they haven't added yet so i just kind of wrote like weekly assignments because I, I don't know what they are yet it kind of helps me out because then i can see it and i kind of put things i make the due date like a, a day or two earlier so that way i'm not like extra stressed because some of them have it due at like 9 a.m and i'm like bruh and you know i color coded it for class and everything while we're waiting for class to start let me show you guys my organization system for this quarter i don't know if this one will work out but you know we'll see how it goes for this quarter if i want to change it next quarter i can but basically what i did is i got three binders which if you watched my preparing for online college vlog you would know i labeled them with my class and it looks so pretty i used washi tape and that writing style where you do like that so what i did on the front cover of all of these is i wrote the super important dates and the class makeup so i know like what I have to do for all of them. Then inside of them, I put these syllabi, and then I think I'm gonna take notes loose leaf this year if I take them by hand. If I type them, then I'll just, I don't know, print it and like do that. And I also saw this cool TikTok hack that I'm gonna try to use when we get to using slides. So in here, I just put some loose leaf paper. I like this because then the spiral doesn't get in the way when I'm trying to write. It's 8.48 now. It's time for me to start getting ready. I got my paper in case there's anything important that I need to like write down. I'm gonna pen because that's what I associate this class with. I'm nervous to go in early because I feel like it's gonna be just me and him. And then I'm gonna, I mean, I want to like talk to my professors to establish that relationship, but I also don't wanna be like the only one in there. This is my first Zoom of college. It's 8.51, I guess I'll go ahead and join. I'm nervous, but I need to make sure it works, so. Hi. <laughs> So I just finished my class. We basically just went over the syllabus, but I am in charge of making the group chat. So I have to add everybody's phone numbers into my phone and then I'll make it. My mouth is in a lot of pain. I haven't mentioned this to you guys yet, but something weird going on here. And then there's like, I don't know what's going on back here. I have gum problems, it's, it's an issue. So my mouth is in a lot of pain lately as well. I have a couple assignments that are due on Monday at 9 a.m. So I'm probably gonna get those done today or tomorrow because I like to get things done ASAP because I have a lot on my plate so i mean i figure i might as well done, get it done fast so that if more stuff comes up i can do it you know that's my motto i don't procrastinate i'm very proud to say i gotta do my fafsa again because it is october my mouth is still uh, it's in pain i'm in pain anyway i can't wait to edit this vlog i'm sorry that i've been like a talking head but like honestly like girl what am i gonna show y'all this is <laughs> this is what college is me watching videos you watching me watch videos <laughs> Actually, I have to sign up for something, so let me see if he posted it yet. I'm not sure because he was talking to someone. I am speeding it up because I, I don't know, I, I talk really fast and like I need the world to talk really fast too. I'm gonna go ahead and hop onto my Education 40 discussion, the one I did yesterday, and reply to one person, maybe two, and then I'll hop on another day because we need to reply on different days for some reason. And then I am gonna print out the article that I need to read for Education 50 by Monday, and then I have to watch a couple videos for it too. And then I need to work on my Euro Studies uh, reflection, it's like a discussion question, and then I think I need to watch a video and answer some questions, something like that. So I'm gonna see how much of that I can get done. I also want to work on some video outlines because this is gonna be like my last weekend to like fully devote 
to YouTube and everything. After this, I'm gonna be super busy, so I don't know how much time I will have to get everything done. Plus there's a video I need to make for something I'm applying to. So there's one video for YouTube that I'm working on this weekend and there's one for the application I need to submit that I'm gonna work on. Ow, my teeth hurt. It is 10.34 right now, so I'm gonna see how much of that I can get done before I gotta start getting ready for work. I should also probably eat something. That's something I've not been great about because hear me out, hear me out. I used to be waking up at like 10 or like nine something. And so then I would just eat like a brunch, but now I wake up earlier. What is happening? Girl, what? So my printer really said no. It thinks the door is open because the door was broken and then I accidentally broke it more yesterday when I had that other paper jam. So I'm gonna go <laughs> try to do whatever else I can. So I took very intense notes on what languages are spoken in Europe and I took the little quiz that goes with it and I'm very hungry. My stomach has been growling at me during that quiz, so I'm gonna go eat. I revised my outline for the video that I need to film this weekend. It's almost time for me to head out. So I'm gonna go ahead and come up with some goals for work because I have my performance evaluation today. Just finished work. I'm gonna head home now. Hello guys, so I am home from work now. It wasn't chill at first. Like virtual learning is tough and I'm basically being like a tutor sometimes to them, so especially one kid. So we did that. They had snack, we did like Uno and then they had like PE. We did a word search, we played categories, then we played Liar, and then we play they were playing some other game while I cleaned all the tables and everything. My performance evaluation was fine. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here because you guys have been watching me do schoolwork for a very long time. Like literally I've almost filled up this memory card and it's 128 gig. Wait, no it's not. Oh my God, I'm dumb. I put the 32 gig one in here. I was like, girl, how to fill this so fast? I will see you guys when college life gets easier. I don't know. Yeah, I'll talk to you guys in another video. Okay, bye.